All right, y'all, this is a real powerful video, and I want y'all to sink your minds into this because you're going to need to be awake to understand what I'm saying. All y'all world leaders work for the same people. All y'all world leaders are the same people. All y'all world leaders are on the same team. You want to know who their ops are? It is us. Anybody out there in another country is watching this. I'm on your side. You on my side and you don't even know it. Because your world leaders and my world leader, they work for the same people. The same organization. They are the same. They're playing the game. And who are the game players? It is us. Until we wake up. If we don't wake up, then we will not know the truth. They say the truth will set you free and they say the truth hurts. Let me explain something to y'all. There is no war. There is no war. Do they send people over there that don't know what they're doing and know what's going on? Absolutely. Suit them up, boot them up, ship them out, go. Then they go, don't even really know what they fighting for. But the ones that give the commands already know what it's hitting for. All we got to do is put the blue and the reds together. That's the Democrats and the Republicans. They going to pick sides. Gang banging at its best. Gang banging at its best. Only they global gang bangers. They are global gang bangers. When you pick somebody to go in office, they're not helping you. How many times y'all voted for a president and they got in there and ain't nothing happened for you? That's because it's not going to happen for you. They're not for you. It ain't nothing but a game. But they need players. They didn't went as far as sending you emails saying, we noticed you didn't uh, vote this year. You didn't register to vote this year. We noticed that you, we noticed, and you're going to keep on noticing. We can all go, but if the world said, you know what? The whole United States said, we're going to all go vote Republican. They're going to be like, what? Somebody caught on to something. See, the, the, the greatest power, the greatest chess move that they created was separation of people. I understand we don't all speak the same language, but we all know right from wrong. And they got translators out there. Ain't nobody stupid. But they done say, hey, we're going we gonna, we gonna to tap in. And we're going to have them, and they're going to have them. And we really, for us... And they, we, we look, we going at each other's throat. For what? Y'all, they work for the same. They are the same. They work for the same organization. They are the same organization. They are together. They are one. They're not for us. They got a movie y'all with Arnold Schwarzenegger, and I'm sure y'all heard of the Terminator. That wasn't just the movie. The Terminator was the exterminator. And they were supposed to exterminate us. And look, if they can't control the people, remember this. If we can't control the people, we'll destroy the people. Y'all know why y'all got all of this uh uh Nuclear war, talks of war, talks of this happening in this country, the borders, people jumping the fence, getting shot, killed, all that nonsense. It's because, wow, we got to figure out how to get back. They can't control it no more. People done woke up. And then not only that, some people done had enough. Some people been hungry for years. Nobody is feeding them. You got a gut. Look, look, how do you have a president? You are the president of the United States or the president of your country. Over in your country, you got a president, a world leader, whatever they call them. 
He's just a really a world speaker to get out, say a bunch of rah, 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 and don't get nothing done. And we saying, we the people vote for we the people. We the stupid people. Well, I'm not one of them. I, I don't want y'all to be one of them. But if you the world leader, why not lead your people? Well, what do you mean? Well, how does the president of the United States, the president of the United States, but you ain't, you got all this power, you really have no power. Because if you did, then you would lead people out of homelessness. You would lead people out of starvation. You would lead people out of violence. You would go to these cities. All the uh, cities, all the states in Pennsylvania, not Pennsylvania, in Texas, Cleveland, Ohio, uh, Cali, uh, Kentucky. No. All the cities in the world, you the president, you in office for all them years, you can visit the majority of them cities every day. The money ain't coming out of your pocket. Get on the plane, travel, go speak, and then tell the people this is what we're going to give you. Go to each state. Disperse this much help and help thy people. If you don't help thy people, how are you going to call yourself the president? Really? If you call yourself the president, ain't you supposed to be able to help some people? But you can't. But you can't. Like, how are you going to help some people? How are you going to be the president and you can't help nobody? Look, y'all, I'm calling how I see it. You the president and it's homeless people. You the president and you got police brutality. You the president and y'all still have not fixed racism in America. Well, they can't listen, you the president. Y'all should have, y'all making so much, so much nonsense illegal instead of making the right things illegal. Well, it is illegal to drink a can of beer and walk up the street. I didn't say drive a car. I said it's illegal to walk up the street and drink a can of beer. It's illegal to do certain things in your city and the way. But they got the dumbest thing. Oh, you got to be in the house after dark in the park. It's summertime. Nobody going to school. Kids out with their parents. They want to go sit in the park and enjoy the night sky. Right? But it's illegal to do a lot of things in the U.S. to light fireworks. You can't light the big boom, boom, boom. Even if you're in an open field, you can't. But it's not illegal. It is not illegal to... Um, it should be illegal to not help the homeless. It should be illegal to not feed people that need food. It should be illegal to have homelessness. But y'all got laws on stupid stuff. It should be illegal to have somebody go to a job and then they uh, getting paid enough just to live paycheck to paycheck. I shouldn't have to be able to pay bills or you should not have to be able to pay your bills and now you broke. You can't buy nothing to eat because you got to wait till next pay but you only ought to take a certain portion out of that next pay because you didn't make enough this pay. Oh, I'm sorry, you didn't make enough no pays. So you got to portion your check. So slavery does exist. I'm talking about real slavery, y'all. Like going to slave on a clock for a millionaire. That could help the world. But we got world leaders that will not help the people, but they call themselves the president. I'm sorry, in order for you to take that title, the president, play your role. Play your role. How you gonna put on that 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 uh crown and you ain't you ain't putting no work in? You don't go at all these cities and visit the people to see how they doing, go to the projects, you don't go to none of these cities to see what's cracking. Sorry, I'm going to turn around and see what's moving. Okay. You don't go to none of these places to see what's popping. To see if anybody needs anything. You don't go to these local schools when they had these shootings and these kids coming to school, they done lost a friend. No, no, the world leader didn't make these people lose their lives, but where was your presence at? You get the news. You get the news before we do. Where were you at? 
okay, you could get there the next day or in a few hours with the technology that we got nowadays, president could be anywhere he want. I don't care, send a clone out there to talk to the people. They got clones out now, but y'all using clones for the wrong thing. Get the clone out. Let the clone be used to do all of this stuff. That, that, man, keep the people wanting y'all. Y'all want us to vote for y'all or this thing, and that thing ain't for the people. And that's, an, that's all over the world. They're not for us. They're not. They're not for us. Somebody threw something in there, and this is off the video, uh, meaning this is off subject to the video. Somebody said, well, you know, we had, well, we're talking about meats and foods. Let me tell y'all something. I told y'all this a long time ago. I already told y'all this. I told y'all this. Let me go back. Let me go back. 2000 and... 10 to 2011, I told y'all already about um, the food supply. How many cows on the planet in the United States? I'm going to just say that. I don't care about y'all shipping animals from other countries. Even if you wanted to do the whole globe, we could do that. Okay, somebody said, well, we still have the other part of the globe. Let's do the whole globe way older than me and my grandma. We can go back that many years. Add my years to my grandma's years. We've been ran out of cows. We've been ran out of pigs. No, we didn't. Yes, we did. Even went down to the baby pigs and the baby calves. We went down to them. Been demolished them. You got, you've been pumping meats in grocery stores for years. Hundreds of years. What are we really eating? But the y'all world leaders. Love y'all. Stay blessed. I forgot. I got to hurry up and turn this off because the government and the system ain't going to help me take care of what I need to take care of. So I got to go hurry up and go get my hustle on because if not, I won't eat tomorrow. Love y'all. Stay blessed.